does you no good to, to paint a line in the sand and say you need to get to here today when there's no way in hell with the size of crew that they have, they can get there in even 12 hours, right? And work them overtime. You have to think about what you're doing. And make it easier for the crews to get that work done. The EBFC show exists to serve people in the construction industry. Yeah, slipping schedules is, is, it just seems to be the norm. I say there's two ways to run a schedule. You can let the schedule come to you, meaning if something happens, you just say, well, push the end date out, or you can drive the schedule. You can say, okay, this came up, but what can we do? What problem can we solve to make sure it doesn't happen again or catch back up to schedule? Because they're solving the problem of where do we need to put things? How many people do we need? How much space should we be going after on a daily basis? Can't do it. You got to get somebody who can. And that just builds good trust. When people hold their word yeah. and keep their commitments, trust increases in the ability to do more good work.